Hi, I'm Kathleen Texera, Director of Government Affairs for the AGA. The AGA continues to be actively involved in the current health care debate on Capitol Hill. And recently, the focus has been on a plan by Senate Finance Committee Chair Max Baucus, which would expand coverage to the uninsured, and it would also focus on preventative services and would cover life-saving screenings like colorectal cancer, which has been a top priority of the AGA for many, many years. However, many components of this legislation run counter to many of AGA's priorities. And before I get into those, let me just explain a little bit about how this plan would expand coverage to the uninsured. One, it would provide tax credits to small businesses. Um, it would also expand Medicaid eligibility. It would also create an insurance exchange by which people could go and purchase insurance. Um, and it would also require an individual mandate whereby individuals would be required to carry health insurance by 2013. Although the AGA does support expanding coverage to the uninsured and ensuring that colorectal cancer screenings are covered, we do have some major concerns with this legislation. First, we are concerned that the legislation does not include a long-term fix to the current Medicare physician reimbursement system, which all members agree is broken. Um, instead, the bill just merely provides a one-year fix to physician reimbursement, um, and it alleviates the 21.5% cut that physicians would face in January of 2010. Um, it also provides a primary care bonus of 10%, 5% of which would be financed on the backs of specialists like gastroenterology. And the third major concern is that the bill creates an independent commission that would be charged with making global budgetary decisions that would impact future reimbursement to physicians. This process is moving quickly, but there is still time for you to get involved. So go onto our website and contact your legislators and use the 1-800 number and look for further updates through eDigest and on Twitter. Thank you.